Until recently, U.S. consumers were largely shielded from a direct hit in the U.S.-China trade war. But as of September 1st, clothing and shoes, among other items, face an additional 15 percent tariff when imported from China. Prices for those goods could rise, and female shoppers will likely feel the pain the most. That's because women tend to consume more clothing than men, and more of what they buy is made in China. According to an analysis by the Wall Street Journal, in 2018, 42 percent of girls' and women's shoes and clothing was imported from China. For men and boys, it was only 26 percent. Fashion experts say China's manufacturing infrastructure and know-how makes it an ideal place to make women's apparel that needs to be delivered quickly and is often more detailed than men's. You would go to, for example, Pakistan or Mexico to make a very simple pair of men's jeans or t-shirt. If you want to make something more elaborate with more make in it, uh, and a women's garment, you would probably go to China. J.C. Penney said in a U.S. filing that 13 out of the 19 items in its stores the most impacted by tariffs are for women and girls. It warned that tariffs would have a significant impact on its customers. Female consumers in New York had mixed reactions to the prospect of price hikes due to the tariffs. I really don't mind, even though I wouldn't like to pay more, but... It's understandable when it's something like that. Basically, if people start shopping in the closet more often, then the prices should not affect us as much as we think it will. I will still buy it. The prices went up. Yeah, because yeah, they're not going to be cheaper anywhere else. So you're going to have to buy something. Everybody loves to shop. Dufty says some consumers may be able to shrug off higher prices, but others won't. That 15% is significant. It's going to take the price point of a pair of jeans at Target, let's say they're $29.95. It's going to take them over the tipping point of being over the $30 mark, which can be, you know, really have a resounding effect on a consumer. They can see that as, oh, it, oh that's beyond my pocketbook right now. Mm -hmm. Dufty said that could cause a slowdown in sales at larger U.S. retailers with ripple effects on the broader economy. Karina Huber, CGTN, New York.